That's the weather today, guys. It's raining. Good morning, guys. I am on my way to the hard walk and today of all days it is pouring rain guys I don't know if you can see it in the back on my glass and also I'll show you in the front the roads are wet but it takes a certain level of dedication to leave my house it's now five minutes to eight. The event starts at eight. I am running a little late, but I should be there at least 35, 40 minutes. And the race actually starts about 8.30, so I should get there. But um, yeah, I wish it wasn't raining today. I'm not sure how we're gonna walk in this rain. I think yesterday at work, they told us they're gonna make accommodations by having us um, walk in the parking garage. I don't know how that's gonna work, but that's the backup plan. But I don't like that it's raining like this today. And half of me is saying turn back. Because I don't know if it's gonna be flooding. You know what? <sighs> yeah, guys, I don't think I'm gonna make it. I am not gonna make it this year. Should I go guys? Shouldn't I go? Well, keep watching this video to see if I made it or if I decided to turn back. guys I really had every intention of going to this walk rain or shine but it's raining too hard even visually I can't even see the road so I am going to turn back and take my butt home because I'm not gonna risk it the roads are really really wet I have to stop off and get some breakfast because I didn't eat breakfast because they usually serve breakfast at the hard walk and I was basically planning on that eating there but that didn't work out so I'm gonna stop at Burger King and get some breakfast I was gonna go to Denny's and probably eat some breakfast there but I don't want to come out of the car it's really pouring you can see it from the glass um, I'm a bit disappointed I'm mad that the weather is like this but what can we, what can we do you know what can we do Mother Nature has a plan of its own. Maybe it'll just be a good day for me to just stay inside and watch some movies. I'm off, it's Saturday, so I'm happy. It's very rare I get Saturday off. So yeah, I think I'm gonna do that. But in the meantime, let me get some breakfast. Um, can, can I get um, two croissant which sandwiches? Sausage, bacon, and ham. Sausage? 
And can I have um, no cheese, please? Two sausages, no cheese, okay? Uh -huh. What else? And that's and, um, French toast sticks. Three or five? Five. What else? That's it. Okay, move forward. You know what I hate? When they don't have the covering for the drive through and I'm like wet now because I had to put my windows down and it's no there is no covering they should have coverings over these things because if it's pouring rain ain't nobody want to come to the drive through either that defeats the whole purpose Um, ketchup problem. Thank you. And it's too early to even go shopping. Even if I wanted to go shopping. Because the stores aren't open until 10. And it's now 8.05. So yeah, I'm gonna go back to the house, eat my breakfast, and watch the movies. And if the sun does come out later, I may go outside later. And if I do go outside later, I will vlog. If not, there will be no vlog. Or it may be a vlog combined with this vlog. Yeah. Yeah, we'll be driving in the rain. What a day, what a day, what a day. We'd never predict what's gonna happen in any given day. No matter how much we plan, we can never predict. And so while I'm talking about that, we also cannot predict our health and how we're gonna how long we're gonna live and so we need to just make sure we take as much steps into becoming healthy because heart health is the number one cause of death in the united states um the leading cause of death is heart disease and uh, cardiovascular disease um the different types and they affect both men and women especially when you're over 50 I am over 50 I'm 51 and so I am really 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 trying to focus on making sure I am heart healthy um, and that goes a long way with eating right exercising which I'm starting back doing exercising eating right I gotta get back on track with that I did do the vegan well the not vegan really I did the um, pescatarian lifestyle for a few months this year and I pretty much handled it well I ate a lot of tofu vegetables seafood and then I was craving for steak and I ate steak and that was the beginning of everything again so I started eating meat again and um, I mean I don't feel bad or anything I just wanted my protein but I got my protein from beans before but I really was missing the meat and I started back eating meat again and um, some days I feel very sluggish so I think I might do like fast of um, just having vegan for like a month on one month off with um, abstaining from meat and just eating vegetables one month meat another month like that and just to get like myself like slowly out of the meat eating so I don't know I'll see but let me just focus on these drivers it is so so wet oh my god let's look at the roads wet 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 but I'm almost back to my house and um, yeah I'm just gonna relax for the rest of the day it's still early 
and I was going to start decorating for Christmas tomorrow. So what I might do today is start decorating the house for Christmas. Um, take the decorations out and start putting things up. I was going to get some more stuff today, but it's too wet to go anywhere. So I'll see how tomorrow is. But I will probably vlog a little bit of me decorating. I'll show you guys a little bit of that. And tomorrow, if I go outside, I will definitely show you guys that too. So stay tuned for the rest of this video. I am almost at the house. I can't wait to eat because I'm starving. All right, I'll see you guys in the next clip. Good morning guys it is Sunday morning it is nice and sunny today a little bit sunny at least I'll take some Sun and I have my choose happy shirt on nice and yellow to bring out even more sunshine anyway guys um, welcome to my channel my name is cherry if you are new welcome if you're an existing subscriber thank you so much for your support please continue to watch please don't forget to like share comment and click that notification bell guys so you'll be alerted each time i post a new video yesterday was very rainy and i am just doing a second part of this video following from yesterday because i could not attend the hard walk because of the rain so today is sunday and i typically don't leave the house on sundays but i had to get stuff done that i couldn't get done yesterday so I'm out shopping today and I'm probably going to buy stuff for family and friends because I don't have any other time to go shopping after this because I have a lot of things to do at work. So since I have the day off and the weekend off, I figure no time like the present to get stuff done. I am here with my mom who is already in the store. She's at Home Goods, and we are outside of... So she's already in there and she hates to be on camera, guys. So I can't even let her be on camera. So I will meet her in the store. She has some things. She has some things to get. And I have some gift cards that I got from work. What I love about my job is we get rewarded for different things at work. And I have accumulated a lot of gift cards. That I received let me try to pop you guys up here hey guys so let me show you the gift cards I have a few of them here and some of them of course I'm gonna keep for myself but I figure I'm not gonna use all of them so I'm going to use them to buy presents so I have a $50 gift card for Marshalls TJ Maxx and home goods I have a $25 gift card from Nike and they're all electronic gift cards but I have the barcodes on them. I have another $15 gift card from Nike, a $10 gift card from Red Lobster, a $25 gift card from Nike and I have two Amazon gift cards that I have at home and I have another $25 gift card from Nike. So I have a few Nike gift cards. So I am going to use these today i think i'm gonna keep the nike one for myself but i'm gonna use the others and uh, the amazon and the tj maxx i'm gonna use those and i'm going to also i'm gonna also use this 25 percent off coupon that i have from bath and body it expires today and i also have a 10% off any $35 purchase and a free full-size body care item up to $15 value. So I'm going to use these on gifts as well. I may not show you guys the actual gifts that I buy because sometimes um, those that I that are subscribed to my channel are also family and friends. So I am not going to show that to spoil the surprise. But I'll take you guys in the store with me. So I'll see you guys in store. First up is Home Goods, and, and then I have to go to Hobby Lobby to get some decorations. I need some more decorations for the house. So I'm gonna go there and look for some stuff there. Um, I know they have 60 or 70% off. 
So I'm going to go there and get some stuff. So let me take the scoop on out. And I'll see you guys in home goods. My family's the hardest to buy gifts for, guys. Every year I have to come up with something to get them. And I know what my sister usually likes, but my mom is already getting her what I wanted to get her. So I'm not sure. Dang. Anyways, let me search around and see. I like this table runner. This is 20 bucks. I just totally forgot I'm not supposed to show you guys what I'm gonna get for my friends or family because they're gonna see this video. So I'm gonna hide some of this stuff. Sorry guys, you can't see. I like this though. Okay, I'm gonna get that. Nice. I like this. We also have to pick up a fresh Christmas tree this year again because last year was the first year we had a fresh Christmas tree at the house. So this time we're going to have another one because it's more economical plus it's better to have a fresh tree. And we enjoyed it last year so we're going to have another one but I have to get my sister's SUV to put it on because my car it wouldn't fit. So. Um, that's the last thing to do get a tree and then decorate it which I am the one decorates because I am great at decorating so I'll show you guys my final results once it's done which would not be on this video of course it's gonna be in another video but stay tuned for that and I lost my mom again I have no idea where she is straying around somewhere I just like nice boxes. Ugh, presentation is everything. How much is this box? You don't see the price. Okay, let me step away from that. Plus, I can get boxes at the Dollar Tree, so. But way cheaper. I don't know what the price of those are, but. Oh, look at these. These are cute. Look at these. I guess they're to put on a tree or something. I'm not sure what these are, but they're cute. These are cute too. Oh, it's a gift topper. Fancy, fancy. I like it. I have to get some toys for cash too. This rope is kind of hard. It's too hard. This is too small for his mouth. Don't want him to swallow anything. I know he does love ball, so we should get him a pack of these. Where you'll find wag worthy gifts to truly pamper your pets. Cozy blankets, cuddly bags, and the squeak too. Oh, and a carol to Oh, I wonder if he like this. He does love to pull on stuff. Oh. So cute. this one <laughs> a little hoodie oh. 10 bucks this might be too big for him oops this is cute 
not sure where my mom is. I kept calling her phone and she didn't pick up three times. So I don't know if she left the store and it's at another store because we have stores next door. But I guess I'll find her when I find her. I can't even find her anywhere. Oh well. I'll just continue shopping. I think I also need to go to Burlington too. And I might go to Michael's if I don't find exactly what I want in Hobby Lobby, but I'll see. I found my mom, guys. Her phone was on silent, so she didn't hear me calling her. She's right behind me now. I'm gonna have to keep my eyes on her so I won't lose her again. All right, we're heading out. About to go to the other store. I think I have to go to Dollar Tree and also to um, Ross, other side of the street. So, where's mom? And yeah, so we have to go to Dollar Tree and Dollar Tree, Ross, Marshalls. Marshalls, Ross and Dollar Tree all next to each other across the street. And then we're gonna go to Hobby Lobby, Burlington, and then to the supermarket. And I always forget where I parked. Oh, I'm parked over there. And what is this lady? Oh, she's calling me now. To Dollar Tree and Ross. They are next to each other. getting some Christmas cards how many of you guys drop a comment below still give Christmas cards with your gifts I love giving Christmas cards I know people don't keep their cards but I keep mine most of them I should say so yeah let me know if you guys still buy cards but Dollar Tree has cards two for a dollar guys so if you don't know now you know We're at Ross and I don't think we're gonna stay here too long because the line is long and I don't feel like standing in line so I'm just browsing to see if I see anything that catches my eye as I said I'm looking for more home decor decoration stuff but if I don't see anything I'm definitely leaving Yeah, it's so crowded in here today, guys. Yeah, I think we're gonna just head to Hobby Lobby and maybe Michael's, not sure. But keep watching and I'll let you guys know where I'm gonna be next. They did have a lot of purses out though. A lot of black purses. But I'm still leaving. Mm. 
Are we ready to go? Yeah. yeah. Yeah, we're leaving. It's too crowded in here. I don't have the time or the patience today. Guys, I totally forgot. Hobby Lobby is closed on Sundays. But luckily, it's next to Burlington, so I'm gonna check out Burlington now. See what's good in there. It's starting to get overcast, but the temperature is great, so I can't complain. All right, see you guys inside Burlington. So I got these little decor guys and then I looked at the line and there's wrapped around from all the way to there. So I'm not sure if I'm going to stay in here either because this is a very long line. But I do love Burlington. Oh, this is a nice jacket. Why is this so small? This is cute. I like this jacket, guys. But it's a small. Too small for me. We do have lots and lots of decor here, though. That sensor buzzes. Drive me nuts. Driving me nuts. I know you guys can hear it. Sorry. Sorry, guys. But you have to hear that annoying noise. Oh, these are cute. And these are cute, too. Oh, and these plug in. Guys, it is crowded in Burlington. Crowded. The line is wrapped around like almost twice. My mom is holding space in line for me so I can look around. But I don't know if I want to wait. I really wanted to go to Hobby Lobby. So I guess I'll have to come back for that one. So I'll see what I can see and if I don't think it's worth waiting in line i won't wait in line i do like this wreath although i have a wreath up already see the price of this one oh it's twenty dollars not bad i like this one better than mine actually maybe i could put it at the back door We got out of here easily. My mom held the place in line. Good job, mom. Teamwork. Oh, I left her out. It's open. Well, I thought this was the end, but we forgot we were supposed to go in Target. So I need to get something there. I wanted to check out the dollar spot. Oh, they arranged this target differently. They did some upgrades. I 
Let me tell you guys, my mom, she moves so fast. My mom is 72. I think she turned, no, she's 73. She turned 73 in September. And she moves so quick, like, I can't even keep up with her. I don't even know where she's at. We just came out of the car. And they got the poinsettia. Oh, they got some cute stuff here. If you want to have a cocoa bar, chocolate bar, these are cute. Oh, these are so nice. Look at these boxes. This is super cute. I like this actually. cute stuff here and these little trees I could put along the mantle I guess I'm hang this somewhere these are just too cute these. There's a little pom pom on top. Five dollars. Oh, look at these. This is so cute, too. It's also five dollars. And all the little trees. These are a dollar. Target has lots of pajamas. This section is filled. Tons of pajamas to choose from, guys. Of course, I have to stop and check out the sunglasses. It's cute. It's different. I like this. I like the shape. Ooh, all right, guys, we've come to the end of this vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I am tired. I'm going to head home and eat some Panda Express that I picked up for my mom and I, and I am going to relax for the rest of the day. I was going to include my Christmas decoration on this vlog, but I will leave it for the next vlog. So stay tuned for that video and don't forget to give me a like, thumbs up guys. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.